Welcome to Cashflow Marketplace. I want to explain the differences between commercial real estate, commercial loan, and real estate syndication. Commercial real estate refers to the type of physical asset. So it could be triple net, office building, retail, and strip malls. That's commercial real estate. Commercial loan simply refers to the type of loan that the lenders give that value net worth and liquidity over debt to income ratio. Real estate syndication is a legal process in which people pull money to buy a asset larger than a single individual can buy. So one is the type of asset, one is lender classification, and last one is a legal mechanism. So all those three things actually can play off each other. For example, a GP can say, I am doing a real estate syndication on multifamily. That one sentence actually touches on all three areas, a residential asset, a commercial loan, and a real estate syndication. The multifamily is actually a residential asset. The physical asset itself is residential and not commercial. That GP is taking out a commercial loan. The loan only cares about the net worth and liquidity on the borrower and not necessarily on the debt to income ratio. This is because when you are buying a $20 million apartment complex, which requires about $8 million of down payment, there is almost no amount of income that you could earn to satisfy the debt to income ratio, at least for a very, very selective few. People often confuse multifamily is not necessarily commercial real estate, it is residential real estate. It's just that they are taking out a commercial loan instead of a residential loan. A residential loan is usually a loan given to one unit, primary residence, to four units, duplex, triplex, and the fourplex, and usually looks at your debt to income ratio and not so much on your net worth and liquidity. So what is cash flow marketplace exactly? We focus on real estate syndication, which is the legal mechanism. It turned out that we touch all types of assets. One can use real estate syndication for residential real estate, commercial real estate, oil and gas, ATM machines, even angel investing because we're just the abstraction over how to raise money, not necessarily caring about what is the underlying asset per se. And similarly, whatever type of real estate you do, that will trickle down to what kind of loan that the GP will take out. We only focus on the legal mechanism in which we pull money together. When you are coordinating with a large group of people, it requires document signing, cap table management, investor relations, monthly updates, K1s, etc. So that's what we focus on. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you come out a little bit smarter so you can explain to other people that multifamily is just residential real estate that happens to be taking out a commercial loan and the way that people usually buy large multifamily is through real estate syndication. Thank you and have a great one.